Hello again, this is the Bidster, and uh, I'm about to do another race on Forza 3, but this time I'm going back to the 1970s because uh, I've uh, selected it so that every car that in, that's in the race has to be uh, from 1970 and backwards. So I've chosen the, the uh, Jaguar E type, uh, and then I'm, I'm up against the uh, I'm up against the Chevrolet Cheville, uh, Aston Martin DB5. Ford Mustang, uh, 1970s Ford Mustang, uh, a 69 Charger, a 69 Chevy Camaro, a Ferrari Dino, and a 68 Pontiac GTO. So, some very old cars, and we're going to do a short run round on Valley Coast, uh, four laps. Uh, no driving assists are being used, manual with the clutch is on, and the AI is on high level as you can see there. Check. Yep, everything's fine. Let's go. It's good every now and again just to go back to the old classics to get some good old mechanical grip rather than all uh, the modern day aerodynamic aerodynamic grip and so forth. It's good to just have four wheels, a steering wheel, and an engine, and no driving aids used. And also I have to admit the Jaguar e tab is one of my favourite cars for shape. The shape of the car is just absolutely brilliant. I said that 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 DB that DB5 is a
that view. I had the privilege once at a classic car rally to uh, sit behind the wheel of one of these. Not driving it, but just uh, sit behind the wheel and um, look at the interior. And I'd say in real life it is awesome, the interior in these things. Just the wooden steering wheel just makes everything just seem so just brilliant. Just, it's got like that classic, that old, old school classic feel. You, just, you can't get in it, you can't beat it. I could have one of these in the, in the real world, then I uh, I wouldn't say no. But uh, money is another thing these days. But if I, I wouldn't have one in red, I, that was just a, a default colour. Uh, I would have mine in uh, probably either uh, silver or British Racing Green. like a nice sky blue. So anyway, I hope you all enjoyed that race, uh, that little uh, back to the 70s race. Uh, so there'll be more coming your way shortly. Uh, see you later guys.